What's up guys, Nightingale here, and welcome to another exciting episode of Fallout 4. Today is episode 15. In the last episode, we jumped into this Matrix-like machine and saw some weird stuff. We learned Sean is 10 years old. Or maybe. Uh, not quite sure to be exact on some of the stuff I've seen, but uh, yeah, we'll go with that. And uh, we are going to kind of put that on hold for a minute uh, because I don't want to go to the end of the campaign and like I did my first playthrough of Skyrim. I literally beat it way too early, way too fast, didn't have a whole lot of fun um, doing it that way. So we're just going to kind of wander around for a little bit. Um... It says talk to Nick, so let's talk to Nick real quick. Where is Nick? He is upstairs. I know I just packed up a bunch of medicine and I'm gonna go pick that up real quick. It was right here. Don't mind me. Dirty water. Please. Holy crap, you are. Nice. Sweet. Not enough folks value the TV here. It's a family job. Um, what else can we loot from your place? That is. Bone cutter. Yeah, let's cut some bones with a bone cutter. All right, and might as well raid you. All right, up we go. What, wait, what? Ooh, I can steal. Not that I'm going to, but. The memory den's not accepting new clients right now, sweetheart. Uh, put your bourbon bottle away. Uh, I was already here. What do we got going on here? Huh. Interesting. Hey, Valentine. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my head. <laughs> that was right. I should have killed you when you were on ice. Kellogg. Is that you? What? What are you talking about? You sounded like Kellogg just then. Did I? Huh. Mari said there might be some mnemonic impressions left over. But anyway, I feel fine, so let's get going. I'm gonna head out on my own from here, Nick. Good luck out there. You know where to find me. Yeah, we're not gonna take Nick along with us. Sorry. Me and the pooch. Okay, so I think it's time to go back and uh, help out the uh, uh, Minutemen a little bit. We've kind of neglected them for a few episodes, several. Well, not really. Last episode was us getting handed by that stupid giant crab thing. Well, no, that was the the last episode was talking to Nick, the prior episode. So it was two episodes ago. That stupid hey crap. Gather around. It's spring again. Jeep is back. Now I know y'all are doing your own stuff, but I don't want anyone to Alright. So hey, let's hey. see. Let's take a look. We're gonna do I think this. Let's see. Also we can level up. How's my family doing? So let's uh Let's do that. We have two. I know that's going to help our... Um, that's going to help our settlements. Um...
Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. So our rifles are a little bit better than they were. Inventory. Oh yeah. Much better. I like those numbers. All right, so we are heading to... We're gonna remove our marker and let's go find the settlement, which is... Oh, go to the red rocket. That sounds like a good place to jump from. Probably the closest too. We shall see. All right, we are at the Red Rocket. Let's just swing in and check, make sure. I don't think there's anything. Okay, so this is the old T-45 armor. This was our first power armor. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and head on out. So let's see here, we are going in this direction. Got our trusty firearm all ready to rock and roll. I love this EBR. It's freaking awesome. Let's go ahead and drop you. Got a vertebrate coming in. What is this? Only thing I hate about traveling at night is you don't quite know what you're walking into. But we can only assume. Dog, I am going to smack you. you come from all right put our guns down they're friendly hey there that's close enough stranger we're a peaceful farm we don't want any trouble it's okay I'm friendly not looking to cause any trouble if you say so but be warned we're armed here so don't try anything let me tell you farming ain't easy out in the field all day every day and every minute of it spent watching your back. Farming's hard work. Won't argue with that. Blake Abernathy, you new to the Commonwealth? <laughs> I've been around. Good to see a new face. How about you? Ever think about work in the land? Don't know. Never really thought about it. Hell, neither did I. I was born into it. Word of advice, though. If you do start up a farm, be ready to deal with the raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? Bastards. All of them. Last time those raiders hit us, my daughter Mary tried to stand up to them. Now she's buried out back of the house. Only 21 years old, and they shot her down without a thought. That's why we need the Minutemen back. And the sooner, the better. There's nothing worse than losing a child. Believe me, I know. I'm sorry to hear you say so. I don't have much to offer, but 
Those raiders that killed Mary, they took her locket, too. It's been in Connie's family for generations. If you could get it back, it'd mean a lot to us. Yeah, we can do that. Don't worry. I'll get that locket back for you. Good. Connie feels like it's a part of Mary. I don't think she'll rest easy again as long as it's gone. Yep, we can do that. We can definitely do that. We'll just jump from here. Make life a lot easier. I heard gunshots from down in this area. Odd. All right. Let's bring back the EBR. There we go. Walking out in the woods, you never know what you're gonna run across. Bears, roaches, Gigantic scorpions the size of uh, cows. Ghouls. Super mutants. The list goes on and on. Make sure I'm going in the right direction. Yes, I am. All right. And sorry, the frame rate's tanking on this. I have no idea what is up with that. Nothing's changed. Yeah, he's getting a bad feeling about it, just like I am. Or she, or... Actually, I think the real dog meat is a she. Alright. So, let's do this the fun way. Stealth, precision, and... There is no way I'm detected. If anything, they're detecting dog meat. They sure as heck aren't detecting me. Alright, I want that dog first. There you are. There's the pooch. Okay, that's that's the button I'm looking for. Crud, now I gotta wait for them to come back. Alright. So they walk down. They're gonna walk back up. Yeah, I could just run in and go guns blazing. Oh, there's one even over there. Um, whoops, how do I get out of that? I didn't even see that one. Is that what was detected? What I got detected by? Let's see if we can wax these people. 
All right. You know what? Oh, I saw him. He's over here in the door. What on earth is that? You're going to get me in some serious trouble. Oh, I just saw the stupid dog. stem pack you no I just think I stem packed myself oh hi all right first kill one shot one kill Props to the military who actually sits in camps and just does this. Picks them off one by one. You are my hero. Let's do this. Oh, see, I enjoy playing this like a military operations game. I know most of you are probably like, dude, just run around and YOLO it. It's like Skyrim, but better to those who think this is better than Skyrim. Lots of cool stuff in there to loot. Oh, it's on. Who saw me? I'm so about to get just one shot, I bet. You gotta reload sometime, asshole. Dude, I hadn't even sh had one shot. Shit! Lost him. I believe you are in here. Oh, hi. I see you. Takes care of you. Think you can hide? Yeah, I can. the one hiding behind a uh, 
Oh, hi. <laughs> what was that all about? Minigun? You were really gonna try to kill me with a minigun. I mean, I'll take the 500 rounds. I, mean, I got room for it, so might as well. Wait, I shot you in the arm and you got. Oh god, you. That's pathetic. All that good stuff. All right, I think. Dog. All right. Let's get out of here and give him, give this poor man his daughter's locket. Poor soul. See, I need to get the lock uh, picking up so that I can get in whatever's. Oh, a nuke. That's why. That's why you're hiding behind an advanced terminal. There's a nuke in there. I need to get one of. The, I need to carry that on me at all times. I think that would be. I've got to use that once or twice. That'd be a lot of fun. Go in and literally just drop a nuke on a boss. Now, if this was real life damage, that thing would just absolutely obliterate it. But we know that doesn't exist. Because let's be real. They're not going to do this because it's a video game. Where are you? Ow. Wow, I actually hit you. All right, so let's travel back to the farm. Where are you, where are you, where are you? Good grief. All right, let's go. Give this back to your daughter. Now, some of you may be complaining, going, why are you fast traveling? To make the episode shorter and to do more in an episode. That's why. Because that would be 25, 30 minutes worth of walking. Hello, sunshine. I've got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. Whatever the Minutemen need, you can count on us. We got a decent workshop. And Connie's sure to go lean around her prices after what you've done. Sweet. I, I hear shooting, but I'm trying to figure out where it's coming from. Let's see. Um, you know what? Let's check in at our... Let's check in at Sanctuary and see what's going on. Depending on what we got left, try to do something else. Alright, there's our power armor. There's our frame. Hey, there's dance. Chilling out in the garden. Way to go. At least I know if he if he's here, they're gonna he's gonna protect this place. That's for sure. Alright. 
Um, so let's do this real quick. Um, we have eight beds, so we have eight people. Um, let's add a bed or two. Furniture, beds. Oh, I need more cloth. Crud. Uh... I'll probably just add some in and we'll go make... I need to make a place for these beds. Like, I need a specific space for beds. Um... At least it's not raining. You ask me, freedom's always worth fighting for. Absolutely it is. You know, we could set up the beds here. Just set up, like, four generators of... Of, uh, what do you call? Generators. Of, uh, uh, turrets. To protect. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. I meant to grab this. Who are you and what are you? Under attack. My old man taught me that duct tape could fix anything. I don't think he was talking about bullet holes. Nope, definitely not bullet holes. All right, um, because I've claimed this pad for me. This is my little workshop for my power armors, my workstations. Uh, if that stupid planting thing wasn't bugged, I was going to turn that into a garden, but, uh, that's severely, 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 severely bugged. I hope they fix it, because that was a great idea. Um, it's a great idea for a mod. Um, here's our water plants, which are doing fantastic. You know, I should just create one big generator now and power them all off the massive generator. You know what? Actually, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to sign off, and I'm going to do some more work around here. I'm going to see if I can upgrade this. And then the next episode, I'll start up here, and uh, we'll show off the progress if I've tweaked this up enough. Because uh, I think it's time we turn this into Sanctuary, the city of all Doesn't cities. It feel good to be a part of something uh, I think we should get more people here. I don't remember. I don't know what the cap is for Max... Um, for max uh, um, settlers here so let's just call it quits here so thank you guys for watching make sure to subscribe hit that like button and we'll see you in the next episode your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil you're taking me home to my father yes stand next to me and hold still okay